Jerry from Archbishop Italy Boarding Primary School. My name is John Jagu, the deputy head teacher at Mishubitari Boarding Primary School. My name is Henry Chege Kamande. I'm a PTA member uh, at uh, Archbishop Gitari, Jokene. Archbishop Gitari is a mixed boarding primary school which is located in the pleasant surroundings of Jokene, Kirinyaga County. It is three kilometers north of PI at the farthest end of Kirinyaga County that borders Embu County. It was founded in 1992 and sponsored by the Anglican Church of Kenya as it was opened by the late Archbishop Gitari. Let me begin by saying that uh, this is a mixed boarding primary school which started in the year 1992 under sponsorship of Anglican Church of Kenya. It was a brain child of the late Archbishop David Gitari. It, is that, it, it, it starts from class 4 uh, to 8 with a current enrollment of 350 pupils, out of which 110 are candidates, that's the 2019 candidates of the, uh, this year. And uh, let me also say that uh, last year we produced the, one of the best people in Kirinyaga County, who scored 425 marks. He was found closing by a boy with 423 marks, and then came uh, with 420 mark. It's important to me, for me to say that academically the school is performing very well because last year we are able to register 338 mark and this year we project to get a mean score of 353 mark. I am the deputy chairman in this school and right now we are in it, we are in it not busy studying we are having science groups and it's not, it's not the only class in class 8, we have 8 South, 8 East and 8 West and these classes they are, they are categorized according to our abilities and 8 North it's the first class. The previous exam the class 8 had a mean score of 371 but our KCP we aim at 375 and the KCP dates they are from 28th to 31st and right now we are working so hard so that we can achieve our goals in KCP and with the help of God we know we are going to make it. Academic programs are run by well-organized departments to ensure smooth running of activities in the school. Each department is headed by a head of department. They include academics, technical, boarding, sports and societies. Attention. You're not my time. Attention. You're not my time. Attention. Attention. At is a lot of left hand, a right hand, a bow down and a kibo. At is a lot of left hand, a right hand, a bow down. Military, military, a bow down. Military, military about gun. Dancing, clapping about gun. Once and hold. Licking up our matata. 
Agosi tulioenda, michezo ikawa tata, hatuchezi wala kwenda. Siyasa zika tunata, hewa siyasa kupanda. Ndiyo sasa taungana, handi sheki ni muhimu. Biashara kuangamia, uchumi kadhika. Watu wakangamia, makazi akachomeka. Shilingi kazimia, ndivyo wao kutosheka. Ndiyo sasa taungana, handi sheki ni muhimu. Tumia vijana mweke wazi hotazeni Sona kazi sana sana mkaweke asumu Kawa shida kupatana amali kawangumu Ndiyo sasa tongana handi sheki ni muhimu Kazi sasa tufanyeni Kenya na tuitaji Tuzameni biwandani iwake huko siraji Hata kule mashambani kazi na tuitaji Ndiyo sasa tongana handi sheki ni muhimu Kenya wataka mema, barabara na utumi Shule wazende jema, hata baraste zalami Wanaoishi kwa hema, mbona hawa wahami Diyo sasa tongana, handi sheki ni mwini the institution has benefited from the digital literacy program which has assisted pupils in gaining knowledge in the world of technology. I'm in charge of their ICT and we have very good plans for the school. We want to convert this school to an institution of excellence uh, in terms of uh, ICT usage. Um, our main aim and our main target is to see the ICT uh, department uh, doing a lot in terms of upgrading the school main score. So our optimum dream is to see ICT uh, uh, doing so much in terms of uh, the excellence of this school. It has a total of 26 members of both teaching and non-teaching staff so as to improve the academic growth of pupils. We have 13 members of uh, teaching staff, 13 members of support staff. Bishop Gitari has many infrastructural developments. The school has an ICT laboratory. A dining hall. An ultra-modern administration block that harbors a number of departmental offices. They have dormitories with a conducive environment that hosts all the 352 pupils. The school has an extension of 33 acre farm which benefit the school with the proceedings which are used to subsidize the school fees. Uh, we have a very big uh, shamba of not less than 33 acres and uh, we have everything ranging from coffee, we have bananas, We have fish farming. We have the the pigs. We have the uh, the cows. The production of this farm is what we are focusing on, because the proceeds of the farm are used to bring down the school fees in terms of sub, uh, subsidy. The farm in a, in a good year 
rakes in around 2.5 million, which is divided among the, uh, the, uh, the students we have. Hence, subsidizing the school fees with about 10,000 per kid. So, on top of the agenda, the board want to ensure that uh, we use all the best practices in terms of uh, farm production so that we can enhance production and double what we have right now. And that one will bring down our school fees uh, tremendously to the level that each and every parent will be comfortable in bringing his or her uh, child to this school. So the board is behind the management of this school and we are ready to give them support to ensure that this school excels in each and every sector. The school holds interviews for pupils from class 4 to class 6 for enrollment. We shall have three interviews. The first one will be 21st October 2019. The second interview will be held on 18th November 2019. And the last one on 16th December the year 2019. So, we have a lot of people who interview. Now, as a good summer, my name is Yendere. For more information, contact 0715374800. Zero seven one five three seven four eight five four. As we mark the twenty seventh year of its existence under the administration of Mrs. Florence Wambogo, the headmistress, with the help of John Jage, the deputy head teacher, and Henry Chege, PTA chairman, we hope to raise the academic buzz of Akubisha Kitaru Mixed Boarding Primary School by producing an all round person who fits in the modern society.